This week, we have a Toyota hot hatch, a bunch of crazy supercars, and the fastest Camaro ever. This week, we have a lot of news about new cars that will debut at the Geneva Motor Show, and one of them is Toyota's upcoming hot hatch. To keep the hordes of Toyota performance fans satisfied until the Super gets here, the Japanese automaker will have the Toyota Yaris GRMN, which will have a supercharged 1.8 liter four cylinder engine outputting 210 horsepower. GRMN apparently stands for Gazoo Racing Masters of the Nurburgring. Not much else is known about this Yaris, except it's inspired by Toyota's return to the World Rally Championship and it will compete with the Ford Fiesta ST. North American availability has not yet been confirmed. Mercedes will also have a couple of interesting debuts for the Geneva Motor Show. Mercedes will for sure debut an E-Class convertible, but it has also been rumored that they will debut a fastback AMG GT sedan to compete with the Porsche Panamera and the Audi RS7. If it does make it to production, the four-door fastback might be called the GT4 and it will replace the aging CLS and come with a twin-turbo 4.0-liter V8 engine with around 600 horsepower. The Geneva Motor Show is known for huge supercar debuts and McLaren is joining in on the fun. McLaren will debut the next generation Super Series car. Believed to be called the 720S, it's been confirmed that the supercar will be powered by a 4-liter twin-turbo V8 that can rocket the coupe to 124 miles an hour in 7.8 seconds. From that speed, it can also break to a standstill in just 4.6 seconds at 117 meters, a figure that's close to the McLaren P1. The new supercar will be built around a lightweight carbon fiber monocoque, have an advanced adaptive chassis with a variable drift mode and an active wing. There's also a new really obscure Italian supercar debuting at Geneva that has the same motor as the Audi R8. Etel Design, which is the same design house that brought us such famous cars as the Lotus Esprit, the DeLorean, the Volkswagen Scirocco and uh, the Daewoo Lanos, is coming out with the new supercar. It doesn't have a name yet, but it's based on a modular chassis made of carbon fiber and aluminum. Under the hood, it'll get a 5.2 liter V10 that'll get the car to 60 miles an hour in just 3.2 seconds and onto a top speed of 205 miles an hour. Only five of these cars will be produced and we hope that those five owners can unsee that little face we spotted on the hood. Why, hello there. And now for something totally different, the ZL1 Camaro has been confirmed as the fastest Camaro ever. With a verified top speed of 198 miles an hour, the Camaro ZL1, equipped with the new 10-speed automatic transmission, is faster than the BMW M5 Competition and the Jaguar F-Type R. The ZL1 was tested flat out at the high-speed oval at Germany's automotive testing facility, and the car was completely stock, including tires, except for the data logging equipment and mandatory extra safety gear. Powered by a supercharged 6.2 liter V8, the ZL1 outputs 650 horsepower and 650 pound-feet of torque. All in, the ZL1 can rocket to 60 miles an hour in 3.5 seconds, finish the quarter mile in 11.4 seconds, and achieve 1.02 Gs of max cornering. Thanks for watching and make sure you subscribe so you never miss one of our weekly news updates.